Sagittarius. In the past, we have the Four of Wands, the Queen of Wands sideways and the Tower. The Four of Wands is a card of celebration. It is the 1111 card and can represent marriage. The Queen of Wands sideways, I believe is you, male or female, and the Tower is a situation that shook your world and I'm feeling not in a good way. The universe has a way of stepping in and forcing you to change your circumstances if they are not for your highest good and you aren't going to make those changes on your own. The Four of Wands is clarified by Temperance, the Sun and the Six of Wands in reverse. Temperance is you again. This is the Sag card, representing balance, harmony and alchemy. The Sun, the happiest card in the deck, yet with Six Wands reversed, there was no victory. I feel like you felt like you were in the best place you had ever been within yourself. There was a partnership that made you very happy, but it ended. The Queen of Wands sideways clarified by the Queen of Pentacles reversed, Three of Swords reversed and Four of Wands. With the Queen of Wands sideways, you took a hit from this. One day you're feeling great and the next not so great. With the Queen of Pentacles reversed, it rocked you to your foundation. With Three Swords reversed and Four of Wands, again, I actually feel like from this situation, you learnt your happiness doesn't come from another person. It comes from within and you did the work to heal on your own. The Tower clarified by the Hierophant reversed, the Wheel reversed and Nine Swords. These cards are telling me I'm being too casual in the description of this situation. This was one of the hardest lessons for you this lifetime. And with the Tower, you may not have seen it coming as in the event went down very quickly. The Hierophant in reverse, it could have been a marriage or someone you thought you would marry. The wheel in reverse is a reminder, and with the tower, everything is divinely guided by the universe. The timing was not right. One or both of you may have had karma or lessons to learn, and with nine swords, this was devastatingly stressful and heartbreaking. In the present, we have the eight of wands reversed, the magician reversed, and the king of pentacles. Eight wands reversed can be no communication, no forward movement. With the magician reversed, you feel like nothing is manifesting. You're stuck. But then we have a King of Pentacles. The King of Pentacles is grounded, stable, loving and kind and abundant. The Eight of Wands reversed, clarified by the Chariot reversed, the Hangman reversed and Eight of Wands upright. This is so funny, as in a contradiction. Eight Wands reversed and Chariot reversed is how I think you see the situation. Nothing much is going on, you're good, you're doing life, but things are quiet. The Hangman reverse is forward movement and Eight Wands is extremely fast, passionate movement. I just feel like you can't see everything that is happening. The universe is working behind the scenes for you. The Magician reversed is clarified by three wands, five pentacles and the Hermit. With these cards, I feel like you have been doing the work. The three of wands is waiting for your ships to come in, and they are by the way. The five of pentacles is being left out in the cold and abandonment issues, but with the Hermit upright, you have been on a spiritual journey. And this person on the card is glowing and elevated off the ground. The King of Pentacles is clarified by the Queen of Cups, Seven of Cups and the Star. Is this King of Pentacles, sorry, if this King of Pentacles isn't someone in your life or approaching you, it could be you. Being stable in yourself in the 3D world, you provide everything you need for yourself. With the Queen of Cups, very in tune with your intuition and emotions. The man on the Seven of Cups makes me think though, this King isn't you. You're actually a wish fulfillment. For them with the star card here and they know it but might be hesitant to approach in the future we have the queen of pentacles justice nine of cups reversed so now we have a matched pair a king and queen of pentacles with the justice card i feel like the universe is stepping in to restore balance probably due to that past situation among other things where in the past you weren't treated honorably with this nine of cups reversed you haven't got your fish wish fulfillment yet the Queen of Pentacles is clarified by the Queen of Swords, the Knight of Pentacles, the Five of Swords reversed. Wow, you are a force to be reckoned with. You have shown up in this reading as three out of four queens. So far, Queen of Wands, passionate, know your worth. Queen of Pentacles, loving, kind, stable. And Queen of Swords, this isn't your first rodeo. You know who you are and your energy communicates this. The Nine of Pentacles, single and doing you, and the Five of Swords reversed, no longer worried or stressing. You are good. The Justice card is clarified by the King of Pentacles again, the Empress reversed and Justice reversed. Again, the contradicting cards. I think the universe is like, yep, I'm working on your King of Pentacles to balance out the scales, and you're here 
as the empress in reverse, happy and good in who you are, but not thinking you want to bother the universe by asking for more abundance. Even though you know with this justice card reversed, what went down in the past wasn't fair, but you're like, it is what it is. We are all doing the best we can. The Nine of Cups reversed, clarified by the King of Swords sideways, Six of Pentacles sideways, Four Swords reversed and the Strength card. I actually think the King of Pentacles headed your way has been through his own injustice and you're a gift for each other to balance the scales. He too is this King of Swords and may have had a situation in the past where he gave more than he received with Six Pentacles reversed, or sorry, sideways. The Four of Swords reversed, you both healed, and with strength, I feel like you both may be hesitant, but there will be a knowing to trust and step forward to see what this could be. Nice energy, Sag. A possible new romance in the future that will feel, so, will feel too good to be true for both of you.